Hey man, it's Bird 28 Degree. We're back with another video. In this video, I'm gonna show y'all how to get the creases out your Air Force Ones. Man, let's get it. All this fake love is played out. Huh? I never got the love I gave out. I'm still stuck in this maze trying to find my way out. Take away my pain, better days I pray about. Cause I'm so sick of all this fake love. Fake love, I'm so sick of all this fake love. Fake love, I'm so sick of all this fake love. Fake love, every single day I wake up. Huh? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm sorry I ain't been able to upload these past couple weeks. It's been kind of crazy with this corona going around. And since I can't work out and stuff and get ready for football season, I just decided to get my first job. At <laughs> food line, but sadly, I never got to start that job. Aww. I got a better job opportunity than I took. But. I was thankful for the job opportunity, but enough about my personal life. I'm gonna have to get y'all right before Corona time over. And y'all wanna step back out and y'all fresh whites, but they all creased up. I'm gonna get it all set up for you. I'll be right back. Back. As you can see, these shoes, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see how creased it is because the light kind of bright, but they're really creased. It's like somebody just got on them and just stepped right on the TV show. But. Hopefully we'll be able to fix them. But all you need is, first off, we had to unlace these shoes. But what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to take this off. It don't even matter what you use for it. You use socks or you use anything. You need something to like bunch, bunch down in front of the shoe and like puff it out. So the iron can get the wrinkles out. You can use a rag. It could be a white rag or just a rag that don't got much color in it, so if the color don't rub off on the shoes. And you get a cup of water. And you need the yeah, iron. So, first, we gotta take these shoe strings out. Alright, I'm back. I got all the laces all out and stuff. Now, you're gonna have to put the tongue up. I'm using Daniel. I just use some, some random stuff I got in my basement. You just stuff it down in the shoe really tight, as tight as you can. Kind of puff it out. Put this in there too. See how it like push, pushes it out. That's so when you you bump the creases out and I like make sure the shoe is still. And now I got it all in there. Now you got to use a cup of water. What I do is I just dip it in there and get it down. You gotta have your rag damp or oil well, match your shoes up when you're damping the rag. And you squeeze out the cup. And then, you see where the crease is at? It's real, these creases are bad right here. I don't know if I'm gonna get that right now. But, you shake the rag. Shake the rag and put it on there. Take the iron. I got crease right here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start on the side for this. It's gonna make a noise, but it's all right. It's not, it's not burning in shoes because you got water on it. Yeah. It's not like you're making the hamburgers or something. You just run it back and forth. Back and forth. We'll get right here too. We we'll rub it a little it might sound like it's me burning it, but it's not. I've done this so many times. This is up. Love it. Some of the creases you might have to take a little longer, but you don't want to leave it on that too, too long, though. You don't make sure you get them out, though. Just keep them um, It's real bad creases right here. I'm gonna have to take my time right here. 
and you just lift it back to look at the crease and see how much more you know, iron out. You don't gotta press it hard or nothing, you just keep going back and forth. Make sure it ain't drying out. Now I'm gonna start on the next shoe. I finna just show you can see. It came a long way from where it was at. Now it ain't so bad, but now we're gonna do the same just shoe the same way. We'll get our stuff. We're gonna stuff it in there. Stuff it in there. Make sure you stuff it in there tight. I'm gonna it real tight, as tight as you can. All right. Let's go ahead and do it. Drain it out of the cup. Now we're gonna start on this shoe. Man, it's time you get a fresh hamburger on the grill, for real. But that's good, that's how you know it works. You really know it like that. That's how you know it ain't gonna burn the shoe to the damp. So now you can see I'm done. I didn't get every single crease out of these shoes because they were really, really, really badly creased. But I got most creases out. And now at least they wearable. Ain't nobody gonna fry you for wearing creased up sandwich shoes. For them. But yeah, got, I got most creases out. It was a real bad crease right here. I got that out, but I'm gonna turn the camera back to me. But now I'm gonna be doing the before and after video. Should be coming up right now. Y'all do not know what it's about to you about to be in with. Y'all just don't understand. Kind of time consuming. It can take up to 30 minutes depending on how bad the creases are. If it's like little creases, it won't take no more longer than like two minutes. But I'm gonna do a before and after video so y'all can see what they look like before and what they look like now. And trust me, they look much more better. They don't look like crackhead shoes no more, but it's birds swing the great. I'm out. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm gonna have more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, man. I'm out. Right, I'm, I'm gonna take that chance, man. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go and get my own crib. And when you do, you too can hear that sweet sound that goes, goes a little, little something, something like this. this.